So today I'm unboxing more of a series than a specific product. This is the G-Skill Rip Jaws series. Now, these didn't just launch, but what's special about this particular RAM is that it is optimized for the Core i5, and they've actually recently made some revisions. So a lot of the Rip Jaws SKUs have now been changed over to 1.6 volts rather than 1.65 volts. Now what that means, as I'm, and I'm gonna start opening the box here while I explain this, is that you can run them at their rated speed at a much lower voltage, which means less heat and, of course, longer term reliability. Now, the Core i5 is actually a little bit less resilient than the Core i7, the old Core i7 on LGA 1366, to high voltages on the memory controller. So that is why G-Skill, even though it's still spec'd for 1.65 on the Intel side, has actually gone and reduced the voltage even further by more aggressively binning their chips. Now, in terms of binning the RAM chips, G-Skill modules are actually known to reach speeds quite a bit higher than what they're rated for, but these particular ones are DDR3-1600 CL7 modules, and they're quite reasonably priced. Now, let's have a quick look at the RAM spreader itself. First of all, you can see it's got a, like a black, white, and red theme. Very Canadian. I really like it, of course. And then on the other side, you've got your sticker, do not remove, warranty void if removed, and it lists your specs there as well. So this is a 4 gig kit, and I already mentioned the uh, voltage and the speeds. I just want to have a quick look down the heat spreader here. So you can see that the way they've position the heat spreader is such that when you have it actually installed in a computer, heat is able to dissipate up the tunnel sort of here, like that. Okay, I realize it's kind of trivial, it's not going to make a huge difference in cooling, but I've seen some pretty stupid RAM spreaders where the fins come out this way and they block air from actually flowing naturally as the heat rises off the memory module. That said, it's debatable how much of a difference a heat spreader makes, but these do look really cool when you install them in your system. Thank you for checking out my video unboxing of the G-Skill Rip Jaws memory.